and welcome back everyone okay so this is a this is actually another opening so I, w I did say last week i was i wanted to do my collection and show show you what we have in these two boxes over here and just go through what i've pulled so far it would be quite quite fun to do but i did find some nice tins to uh, to open up today so these are tag team tins this is um snorlax and ev one and this is um celebi and venusaur one so uh, these are part of the tag team uh, collection ones and um, some nice packs in there and a, a nice holo um, nice promo cards as well so I'll quickly show you um, what we're talking about so there's three tins in this collection there's um there's another one as well which is a Pikachu and Zekrom that's near impossible to find if you can find that wow you've, you've hit gold there because uh, just the promos itself are actually worth something and they've got some nice packs in there as well so for example the promo in here um, Snorlax and Eevee, that's going for, PSA 10 is going for $103, which is incredible if you think about it. It's just, just the promo, it's just a spare card that comes with it. Uh, and you get four great packs as well. And then if you then if you look at the Venusaur Celebi one, these ones are going for, what, 157 for the promo card itself in a PSA 10 last sold. I do think that's a bit too unrealistic, 157. I think the actual amount that's really going for is about 100, I'd say, in the PSA 10. But I'll just show you what we have in here. So we've got this GX uh, tag team um, marker as well, just like a metal marker. I'll quickly show you the promo card. Let's just get this out. So hopefully we do have a nice one here because um, that'd be pretty nice. Okay, so I'll just get rid of this. That's a code card there so we just look at this promo card for a second it looks pretty in center if i'm if i'm honest it does look quite good centering wise yeah might be a bit of a nick there but let's take, take a look at the back uh that is really nice i think that back is really good for a promo card as well so pro some promo cards i feel sometimes have really bad corners but no that looks good that looks really good okay so like I said, this and the PSA 10, even just getting this graded, and I've got a few of these already. Um, it does look like Snorlax is eating Eevee though, doesn't it? The little leg sticking out looks like, but no, I think it's something else. But very interesting card. Nice looking card as well. And um, yeah, it is crazy that this is going for quite a lot of money. Just a promo. Because if you look at the actual packs in there, you've got some nice packs. Two team-ups. Forbidden Light. And Evolutions. I mean, we know Evolutions is, is the most sought-after pack at the moment, especially with people like Logan Paul opening up uh, base set packs at the moment. So this is like a proper nostalgia for everyone to go in there go there and get Evolutions back. Um, so I'll just show you the last thing as well on this. We do have a tag team little metal marker as well. And I'll set these like, um, packs to the side. I won't go open them just yet. I'll show you the, the other one as well. So let's just put this away for a second. So if I show you the other one, this is the Venusaur Celebi one. Again, it's the same packs inside. Exactly the same packs. I'll show you. So I can open it, that is. I'm not struggling too much, am I? Let's see. Uh, okay, there we are. So if I show you the packs inside again. Again, two team ups. Forbidden Light again, and Evolutions, with another of these metal markers. Let's just take a look at the... Oops, hopefully no one saw that code card. If you have, feel free to redeem it. I'm sure I won't get it anyway. Okay, let's take a look at this promo. Like I said, again, last sold on this is 157 in the PSA 10, which is incredible. I think, again, like I said, most realistic is probably about 100, and that centering looks pretty good again. Maybe a bit top to bottom that bottom looks a bit thicker but the sides look nice take a look at the backs i think corners again you get dinged on sometimes that looks good maybe a little bit of whitening here on this top left but that back looks nice what's that that's a bit of fluff don't worry about that so again we could have another psa 10 here and that's what you've made your money back in just the promo card it seems like because these tens aren't cheap but with the packs that you get in there and the promo cards you are, this well worth the money. It's actually crazy. Um, so I'm going to put this on the side and we'll get into the pack straight away. Nice tins as well. I mean, you can keep that for your collection as well. That's, that's pretty nice. Okay, so I'll go through the packs first. So this will be the first one. Team Up. So Team Up is quite a good set. It's um, 
mainly that Pikachu and Zekrom Rainbow, which is actually incredible. That in the PSA 10 is currently going for $400. $400. It has some nice um, secret rares as well. Um, there's a nice um, alternate art Lashios and Lashias card in the shape of a heart, which is perfect for Valentine's. So everybody get that. And let's just go four from the back. Remember, you've got evolutions in this. Everyone loves evolutions. So we have Metal Energy, Buff Padding, Kabuto, Fairy Charm, Alolan Grimer, Ponyta, Cosmog, Voltorb, Squirtle, that's really nice Squirtle actually, Paris, and a Bronzong. So no non-holographic there. That's alright, like I said, from the promo itself, you've got your money back there, and these team up packs aren't cheap as well. Getting those at the moment are really, really rare. Getting a box of that is incredibly rare. And so let's get into the next pack. Again, we're searching for that Pikachu Zach That would be really nice. I actually haven't even got the original one, the actual GX version, just the regular half art one. We have Dark Energy here. Oops, missed it. Far Fetched, Cosmo, <laughs> uh, Dragonair, Staryu, Litten, Zorua, Weedle. Joltik, Kabuto's Reverse, and a Jirachi. That's a really nice Jirachi, actually. Holographic there. So we got Holographic in the second pack. And I like that Holographic a lot. That's a nice, nice Jirachi. Right, Forbidden Light. Um, this isn't the best set, uh, but you still can get, what is it, Rainbow uh, Greninja is the best card in this set, which is PSA 10 is going for $500. It's got a lot of legendaries as well, so some some nice rainbows in here, but not the not the best set. It's not as hyped as some of the other sets that you can get in the Sun and Moon. But let's see what we can get. Again, fall from the back. Yeah, what was I done? Four. There we are. And we'll save that evolution for last. Okay, Gabite. Sligu. Zygarde. Dog version. Litio. Furfu, another dog. Okay. Inkei. Magnemite. Oops, I don't want to show that. Okay. Hone Edge, and we got Prism Star, so that's Lysandra Prism Star, so this is in reverse holo slot. Prism Stars aren't, they aren't going for a crazy amount, but they, they do, they do look nice, don't they? And we've got a Bomber Snow as a non-holographic. So just one holographic and one Prism. Let's hope Evolution can save this tin. So we know that the bloody hell, the Charizard holographic in Evolution is just going for stupid amounts at the moment. I think last soul we saw it at five thousand in the PSA ten. Five thousand for a holographic Charizard. And again that's just mainly because of the nostalgia factor of this. And people like Logan Paul by spending what two million on um on base set and first edition boxes. And people see that they just want to get base set but they can't so they go go for evolutions instead and it skyrockets the the prices. But PSA nine for evolutions um Charizard is going for only $400, but if you think about that, that that's a massive jump from $400 for PSA 9 to $5,000 in PSA 10. Very nice Charm Medium to start. I do like that card. Venus of Spirit Link, Energy Retrieval, Growlithe, Nidoran, Vulpix, Sandshrew, Ponyta, Energy Retrieval is a reverse, and we have <laughs> Charizard EX. Wow. Okay. Uh, that is incredible. I have actually not pulled this one as well. And so what number is this? This is number 12 out of 108. So I'll just quickly get up the price for this because I've not actually pulled this, like I said. And a Charizard EX Hollow. This is going for, in a PSA 10, at $224 last sold. So if just look at oh, that centering. is off. Do you see that? Look at that centering. This this edge here is so thin compared to the, the left hand side. Yeah, that centering is very bad. So this won't get a ten. This will get a nine. But let's check the back. Okay, that pack. Yeah, you can tell just how bad that centering is. So if, so I'd say this, if this gets a nine, let's just check the price because I've got my laptop here. I've got the price list here. So PSA nine. This card is going for eighty seven dollars. I mean. Oh god, look at that Nick. Maybe a PSA 8 at this rate. Yeah, that, that corner's not very nice at all. But um, very nice trouser. Like I said, another one to add to the collection. I don't have it. Straight away sleeve this up. 
if I can. And that's it. We've got first pull of the day. That's amazing. And what a pull to get as well. I'm still chasing that Charizard holographic. That $5,000 card. But that is amazing. I'll put the promos on the side as well, actually. These are quite nice as well, aren't they? And um, we still got another four packs to go. We still got the other um, half, the other tin to go. So let's go straight. Back and that team up. Again, searching for that. Those two in the front. And then Pikachu and Zekrom. If I can open it, this is. Oh, wow. This is not opening at all. Okay, there we are. What a way to end that first tin. Incredible. Okay, Fighting Energy, Nidorina, Supreme Suggestion, Graveler, Pidgeotto, Nidoran, Cosmog, Magikarp, Zoroa, Alolan Executor is Reverse Rare, and Skarmory. I do like Skarmory though, to be fair. Very nice Johto Pokemon there. Next, um, so this was probably from the, hopefully from the Celebi and Venusaur pack, um, the 10, sorry, so we got the pack as well of it, it's really nice. Got the promo in the background of it. And I'm still reeling after that Charizard pull. Like I said, I don't have it, and so I was really happy with that. The only Charizards I've got from Evolution are the reverse, reverses, yeah, two of those. And we've got the Mega as well. So it's really nice to get that EX version. Rapidash, Puccina, Nidoran, Pancham, Voltorb, oops, I forgot one, Klefki, Execute, Execute, oh god, I can't even pronounce that anymore, I'm still shocked about the Charizard, is the reverse, and we have a Dragonite holographic, very nice Dragonite, do like that card a lot. Some nice holographics from Team Up. Got the Jirachi and the Dragonite, but no, no big cards from that. No, no ultra rares. Okay, another Forbidden Light with that Greninja on the front. Let's hope for that Rainbow, Rainbow Greninja. I feel like it's the only card you want to pull from Forbidden Light. Okay, and let's just give it a code card and fall from the back. Okay, Leaf Energy. Uxie, Yoon Energy, oh, I can't even pronounce that, Pancham, Skidoo, Noibat, Inkei, Fennekin, Skrelp is reverse, and a Tyrantram holographic. We're actually getting the holographics today. I feel like most of the time in our videos we don't really pull many holographics. It's a holographic party and then rare occasion we get something nice like that. But here we are. Charizard pack. Give us some luck. Let's hope this last pack magic. And let's hope for another Charizard. That'd be a beautiful, beautiful opening. So just three from the back from these X, X and Y packs. Just three. We've got Polywell to start. Revive. Slowbro Spirit Link. Nidoran. Poliwag. Grass Energy, Rattata, Vulpix, Reverse is a Super Potion, and a Mewtwo. Okay, it's, it's probably the best non-holographic you can get. Not, not worth the crazy amount, but it's nice. I'm kind of disappointed they relegated Mewtwo from holographic to um, non-holo and evolutions, but it's still, it's still really nice. But um, let's just quickly go through these pools. Well, the main pool, the only pool we got today. But what a pool to get. This Charizard EX and... Um, such a shame about the censoring and the little nick we had at the back, but really nice card to add to the collection, and I'm really happy with that. So let me think, let me know what you think about these tins, and um, tell me what you, whether you think they're a good investment, because like I said, these, these promo cards, I feel like they pay for the tin itself already, and you can get some great packs like Evolutions in there. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Leave a like, subscribe if you can, that'll be amazing, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.